So another question is, what is encryption? Encryption is to convert a plain text into an alternative form known as ciphertext. So the plain text is something that any person who has access to the data can read it and it could be understood by that person that what is written on the paper or any other form of uh, representation of the data. The ciphertext is something that if you are trying to read it, you will not be able to understand because it has been converted from a plain text to a ciphertext through some encryption algorithms. So if it's an encrypted data, it will ensure that any unauthorized person cannot access the data and they cannot understand the data unless it has been deciphered. It has been converted back to the plain text. So who can convert that data backwards to the plain text? Anybody who has access to the secret key through which that data was encrypted in the first place. So when you're talking about encryption, you are ensuring that the confidentiality of that particular data is not compromised because in encryption, when you are encrypting it, the data is now confidential. Nobody who does not have a key through which he can decipher that particular text can read the data. Only authorized person who have the key will be able to decrypt that data and access it. Another concept is non-repudiation. Non-repudiation is that when you do something or when the user commits to do something and he does it, there must be controls in place that ensure that tomorrow the user does not track back on what he did. He cannot say that I did not do anything. Even if he's saying it, the controls should be in place that ensure that he cannot track back, that you can show him the evidence that only you had the access to this particular access account. And that means you have either shared your key with somebody, either shared your access with somebody, or you made the changes. That is non-repetition to ensure that the controls are in place, that no that no user can do something and then deny any involvement or doing of that particular thing. So there are two types of encryptions, symmetric encryption and asymmetric encryption. In a symmetric encryption, you will have a single key with which you will be encrypting it and you will share the same key with which you encrypted to the other person and they will use that key to decrypt that data. So anybody who has that key, he will be authorized person. There is no confidentiality from that person because he has the key, he can decipher it, and he cannot deny that I access the data because he has the key, and whenever he will use the key, he can access the data. In asymmetric encryption, it's not a single key. There are two keys a private key and a public key. And both keys are used. Private key is used to encrypt the data and the public key is used to decipher the encrypted data. Thank you so much. I hope this covers your uh, encryption part and uh, you can answer the questions easily.